<laughs> Who wins at the peak of their powers? Eduardo Correa, Rafa Brandeo. The best of all time is, without a doubt, is... I think, you know, people better not count him out. Now, what, what show is he doing the qualifying again? Yeah, I mean, there's a show in Brazil. I'm going down for it. Oh, you are? Wow. Your yeah, wife's I, letting you go? E vocês aí já sabem, os maiores do Brasil usam G-Farm, o link tá na descrição. E lá na Madrugão você encontra tudo em suplementação, no melhor preço do mercado. E usando meu cupom MN você ainda tem descontos exclusivos. Então não perde tempo e corre lá no link que também está na descrição. Um, I was looking at your uh, Instagram. I, I saw a picture you put up of Rafael Brandeo. Wow, is he looking good? He's big. What does he weigh? No, he looks okay. 122 kilos. What is that in town? I don't, 263. That's great. That's huge, fam, isn't it? Yeah, no, he's dead. He's big. He's he's um You sound like Bob. You're like, oh, he's all right. He's good. No, I mean he's 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 um he's dangerous. I mean, there's just a lot of people who are good and you know, he's beaten Samson Dota. I'm not saying he's gonna beat him again, but I'm saying he could beat him. Yeah. You know, he just has to be at his Raphael just has to be at his all time best. That's what I tell him. Simple as that. You will get a look. You know what's so funny, Dave? What? Uh, I was thinking just today, how would Weinberger judge him? And Weinberger would say, you look great. Just bring your best. Yeah. Because it, it, it's important to, to think outside your own head and think like, okay, to the people who it's most important to, the head judge, how would you judge it? You know, he'd, he'd see him, if he saw him right here, he'd say, don't get small. <laughs> and don't come in off and don't come in, you know, just come in crazy peeled, right? but keep your size. And he said, you'll do great. Yeah. He's got, he's got to come in peel. That that's his, uh, that's his, well, part. it's, it's a, it's, it's, you know, it's, everyone has, um, everyone has some type of weaknesses. And I, I just think that, um, flow and shape why, I mean, he doesn't have a lot of weaknesses on Raphael. Raphael doesn't have a lot of weaknesses. He's got a very good front double, very good front uh, lat. Side triceps, pretty good. Side chest is really good. Back double is very good now. Back lat is decent. Um, Let me. I'm going to hit you with a controversial question. I know all the um, the Brazilian fans are going to uh, are, are on edge. Listening yes, to no, them. no, and yes. <laughs> Who wins at the peak of their powers? Eduardo Correa, Rafa Brandeo. Well, the ones at two twelve and ones no, well, at the peak of their powers at the best of the when the, before even two twelve, you know. Why don't you? Why don't I send you the side tricep of well of uh, Eduardo and you can post it up? He sent it to me two seconds ago, literally. Oh, yeah. okay. you, I'm using now. I'm using. Uh, I'm stealing. Still have, catch, still have, I'm stealing catch words from from. You could from, you could answer the question without getting in trouble because Raphael. Eduardo is I not mean, uh, <laughs> <laughs> um. I said, uh, Eduardo. Who's the best Brazilian bodybuilder? Come on. The best of all time is, without a doubt, is um, Eduardo. Okay. That's, there you go. That's Look at the side tricep, Dave. I'm going to send you. It's just off the hook. From Eduardo. He's he's three weeks out. Yeah, I got to It hasn't come through yet. Yeah, you can... You can Tease the Brazilian fans <laughs> and the, and the, our fans of twelve who hey, all you have don't to, like why us. would uh, Eduardo try to do open? Oh, because you said he hasn't gained back as much. He doesn't have all no. The because the time they did do the open, he should have done. I met him the year he did went through the open. He could have won the Flex Pro, and they dogged him to fifth. What, what did he weigh here? He weighs two twenty here. Do you get the? Do you get that shot? Yeah, I got it. I'm going to try to get it up. Hold on. He's pretty good. Got news for you. He's forty-one now. Oh, he's still young. I, th I thought he was a little older. That that's not bad. I mean, he could still do. He probably has another good five years in him. I would say, as long as he doesn't get injured. His his whole thing has been injury. Oh, he's yeah, he's he's, he's at the most injured injured. I mean, the, the knees, the tricep, the tricep, the knees, the shoulder. But he somehow comes back from all the injuries. That that because he's crazy. He's 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 got incredible focus. Yeah. Pictures up from Korea here. Two twelve. I mean, that's a division. Cool. You said he's two twenty there, right? Yeah, he's two twenty. So why not throw him in the uh, 
Two, 218, 218, 218, 218. Uh, he's right there. He's right there. Because he has no back. <laughs> he's got no back. Shows the one from the Bob Chick would say, <laughs> <laughs> Shows the one from the back, and he's got no back. Yeah. How's his back? Can you get that back shot up there? I'm looking for it right now. Hold on. The, the, the back is. Um, Here it is. Hold on. Well, the picture's worth what? How many words? million words well it was worth a million but with inflation it's worth two million or it's worth nothing all right yes yeah. <laughs> i went backwards yeah <laughs> well it's worth two million but the two million is worth like 50 cents that's a pretty good back shot chris for a guy who doesn't have a back yeah lonnie teeper wouldn't like his calves but you know his well uh, you know what Luke dexter, dexter and ramby won the olympia they have triple zero no calves they have you know, the worst you know, calves in yeah. the history of the sport yeah that is well you know uh Dennis Wolf, I, yeah. I really looked at these pictures like and trying to find like all his injuries and and I it's amazing it's hard to I, find. I don't see it. I don't see his injuries. Do you? Yeah. Well, when when he was second at the Olympia and um let's face it. Probably he could have easily have won and nobody would blink a wink. Right. I remember Ron Harris saying, "Oh, the left arm is so just, it, you know, it, it really, it, it just throws the symmetry, you know, off. Uh, no, he said the right arm. The right arm, it throws the symmetry off. And I'm like, well, the injuries on the left arm won. I was going to say his right arm is better than the left arm. <laughs> you know, and then two, you know, really? Great shot. Really good shot. See, he's gonna. He's. I think you know. People better not count him out. Now, what what show is he doing the qualify again? Yeah, I mean, there's a show in Brazil. I'm going down for it. Oh, you are? Wow. Your yep, wife's I, letting you go. Well, you know what? I've been helping Eduardo since 2009. Oh, if he makes the comeback, you said you'll go. Listen, honestly, Dave, for him to get back on stage is it. You know what? It, it's stunning. Yeah. The, the amount of injuries and surgeries, they're not injuries like, oh, you know, shoulders. No, he had some big time injuries. Shoulders Harris. bother me. You got to get him on the, he's had it all from the shoulder yeah, get him on the show. to the tricep, to the knee, to shrinking down to Logan size. <laughs> and actually the, the, um, this kind of comeback when he said, you know, I want to try it one more time. Yeah. And I think, you know, we got back and forth and, I said, it's going to take you a solid, solid, solid year. So by the time the show rolls around, it will have been a year of, you know, trying to build muscle. Now, what was the latest injury, Chris? Just remind us again. <sighs> Might have been the. <laughs> Is it another bicep tear or something like that? I don't I remember. No, he had something. tricep, shoulder, and knee. Okay. And his legs look good, which is, you know, a testament to. This guy's just a, a monster, you know. Yeah. He's just, he's just, 